Uh, your live shows include, like, we got a list here, hatchets, you wearing lingerie, obviously your guillotine. What was the first stunt that you performed on stage? Well, first of all, I have the body for lingerie. <laughs> I look pretty good in lingerie. Um, the first guillotine? No, the first stunt you performed the first on stage. Stunt, I think it was pretty much... Uh, the very first thing we had was a guillotine on stage. Is it, it really a real was. guillotine? Yeah, yeah. It's, it's a guillotine that if, you, if it hit you, you would definitely die. How it's a 40-pound blade, and it's, it's like razor sharp, and it misses me by about that much. Well, okay, first of all, where do you get a real guillotine? You have it made. Oh, you have it made. Yeah. And why would you have it made with a razor sharp blade? Well, <laughs> because if you use a rubber blade or a styrofoam blade, I know it's fake. And so Alice would go, oh, come on, put a blade in there. You know, put, uh, if it's going to be death-defying, make it so that if it broke, you might die. So you have to give it a certain carnival effect that the guy could fall off the high wire. You know, you kind of look and you go, geez, this is kind of neat. The guy could fall. Well, an accident could happen on Alice stage. Right. You know? uh, tell us about the chicken incident. Okay, the chicken incident now. For all of you kids that don't know the chicken incident. Uh, we're in, in Toronto, and the last part of our show was we open up these feather pillows and feathers everywhere. And the next thing I know, there's a chicken on stage. Now, I didn't bring the chicken. <laughs> and I'm seeing the guy getting ready for the show. He said, I got my wallet, I got my keys, got my drugs, I got my chicken. I got my... <laughs> you don't bring a chicken to a show. Anyways, it was on stage. And I went, well, it's got feathers, it's got wings, it should fly. I'm from Stands Detroit. I, I've never been on a farm in my life. A chicken should fly, in my book. So I took it and I kind of chucked it out there, feeling it would just fly away. It didn't fly as much as it plummeted <laughs> into the audience, and the audience tore it to pieces. I mean, just and threw parts of it back on stage. Next, thing in the, next day in the paper, it says, Alice Cooper rips chicken to pieces and rips the throat out and, you know, and all this stuff. And Zappa calls me up and he goes, did you kill a chicken last night on stage? <laughs> and I said, no. He said, well, don't tell anybody. They love it. You know, they love the fact that you're the geek now. You're the guy eating chickens. Now, the kicker to the story is this. The first five rows to that concert were all in wheelchairs. <laughs> they the were ones? the ones that destroyed the chicken. They hated the chicken. Yeah. So, I mean, there was something even more dark about that. You know? <laughs>